What's up, Guam? I'm Dave Delgado. Welcome to KUAM Sports. Thanks for watching. I'll get to some NBA highlights between the Heat and Nets in just a bit. But first off, your local sports. Check it out. Mike Singletary, NFL Hall of Fame linebacker from the Chicago Bears, is here on island with his son Matt to speak to the graduating class of St. Paul. Mr. Singletary was at the Hilton Tree Bar this morning to talk to the media and sign some autographs. He also gave his thoughts on recently drafted Michael Sam, who is the NFL's first openly gay player. I just feel that, uh, you know, Jeff Fisher, I believe, did the right thing. But at the end of the day, I, I just think that it's important uh, not so much that the game player or open game player, I think what's important, the bottom line is uh, you have to make sure that whoever you have on your team, uh, they can help you win. And that really should be the bottom line uh, to me. The Guam Volleyball Federation will be hosting the 2014 U14 Boys Junior Challenge on May 30th and 31st at the Harvest Christian Academy Family Life Center Gym. Boys interested in joining should contact their respective middle school volleyball coach. For more information on the tournament, contact Kyle Eckert at 488-5179 or Sandra Lowe at 688-8860. This is the second uh, year of it, spearheaded by the GVBF uh, board, where we really wanted to kind of get the youth of Guam more uh, involved in, in some volleyball. So we were trying to... Uh, get more of like both the public and private schools to participate in a tournament together because it just seems like you know you're missing out on half the schools uh, when you have only a double I double AG tournament and a DOE tournament so we're trying to get them to participate more together uh, you know make it one big uh, one volleyball family. Free registration of teams commit by May 23rd with late registration fee from May 24th through the 30th being $75 per team 12 team players listed on the rosters will receive an event t-shirt. Right now we're looking at it uh, being a round robin tournament and then we will finish with a, uh, a single elimination uh, playoff format. And uh, if they register early, then it should be free for the teams that get in early. Right now we have about four teams confirmed. We're looking to try to get 10. We really want to take a look at the talent that we have here in Guam because we do believe that we have a really good talent pool uh, to draw from. So this is actually going to be sort of like a, a way for coaches that are on Guam uh, to come out and see you know, what the talent is that's rising up to our next level, which is high school. So after Miss International of the Marianas will be hosting a charity golf tournament this Saturday at Starts Guam Golf Resort. Showtime is at 11.30 with shotgun time scheduled for 12.30. Early bird entry fee is $200 per team or $100 per person. Entrance fee after May 16th is $250 per team or $125 per person. The format will be two-man best ball. Seroptimus International of the Marianas is a nonprofit organization of women helping other women and girls to improve their lives. And our signature program is the Women Opportunity Awards, um, which we give out financial assistance to head of household women who are trying to get a higher education. In addition, proceeds for our Seroptimus Golf Tournament is going to benefit Erica's House, which is a visitation and exchange service for families here on our island of Guam. So we're very excited to be able to host this golf tournament for our women and girls, and as well as Erica's House. Now for some NBA highlights, the next